both uh, Leila Birch and Andrew Linford of the experience of being in the spotlight on the soap, but who could forget the moment when Teresa DeMarco discovered her boyfriend Tony kissing Simon? You don't know anything about me, Teresa. So tell me, do you love her? That's my business. Yeah, but well, you were quick enough to criticise me and Chris. I still would have taken you back. Even after everything you did. <laughs> what about that? How long ago was that? That was oh, a couple of years uh, now, wasn't it? 98? Something like that, yeah. Mm. About three yeah, years ago. Yeah. You're a very sweet there behind a tree. Yeah. <laughs> what did you do next? Can't remember. History doesn't um, remind me. Did you freak? No, I mean, yeah, that, in that scene. Yeah, you, I think. No, because that was a duff duffer, wasn't it? It was. That was a great big cliffhanger at the end mm. of that particular episode. Oh, right, right, right. And um, I think the. Uh, you know, it all hit the fan as it always mm. does in something like EastEnders, and uh, yeah. I think we hated each other for quite a long yes, time we after did, that, actually, didn't we? Yeah. And understandably well, you would, really. so. <laughs> <laughs> you absolutely would, yeah. Um, <clears throat> you only left last August, didn't you? Yes. Is that right? Yes, I and did. And when, when did you go? I left about a year and a half ago. And you, you yeah. left because you wanted to? That's right, yeah. Um, mm. I'd been there for nearly three and a half years mm. and I had a fabulous time, um, but things were starting to change within the programme. Mm. And, um, you know, new characters have to come in, a soap has to keep evolving and uh, mm. all those polite things that you have to say. <laughs> um, but it is true, you know, and, and, and they beat you to the punch <laughs> before you could That's say... That's a lovely I'm, way of yeah, putting it. Um, um, yeah. No, I think what it was, you know, is that a new executive producer comes in and obviously they want to put Death. their mark on the programme, <laughs> yeah. you know, artistically and everything, which is understandable. Sure. And I had been there two and a half years and, as Andrew was saying, you know, we had some really good storylines, some mm. of which we had together. Yeah. Um, you know, and being involved in the Matthew Rose thing and everything. And yeah. I think being in a show two and a half years is a long time for an actor, so I'm kind sure. of mm. glad the decision was made for me sure. because... It's really nice to go on to other things. No well, well, let's, let, let's see yeah. a scene in which you say rather more than, than you did in that one. We see rather more. When you are actually with Matthew Rose. Here we go. I am sick to the back teeth of this. You know, if I were you, I'd go and see a psychiatrist. Because seriously, you're not well in the head. Tracer, don't go, please. I don't want to be on my own. I'm scared. But why? You keep saying all these things, but you don't say why. <laughs> because I can't cope with it anymore. Help me, please. <laughs> oh, oh, poor old Matthew. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Yeah, he's so good, Joe. Well. Yeah, such a lovely yeah. chap. Yeah. You see, I think, I think you know, you say that we've all we've all kind of left now because soaps do go in phases, don't they? And, and sort of groups yeah. of characters seem to stick yeah. together and then they all move on. Yeah. And that was our era, really. I think. Yeah. And you know, and when you come to the end of it, you sort of say, well, that now's, now's time to now's mm. the time to move on. You know. And by the time I left, there wasn't actually anybody of my age group left. Really? <laughs> there really wasn't. There really wasn't. I had, there was. I think it was just Robbie. Yeah. And that was all. They were either younger, like my little sister's age, yeah. or or older. Well, how old well, are married. you? Is that rude to ask an actress how old she is? I'm 22. 22. Oh, that's very. I young. guess it's rude in about 10 years. Yeah. I won't ask. I won't ask. <laughs> or, or they just lie, like yeah. they did just then. <laughs> so you're acting together now again. Yes. We'll talk about it in a second. I love Agatha Christie. It's an Agatha Christie play. Isn't yeah. It? it is. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. But do you have any inside knowledge? I know you're going to say no because even if you knew that you wouldn't tell us uh, as to um, who <laughs> well, shot. Oh, you mean <laughs> this? <laughs> you <laughs> shot. Couldn't help noticing. No, we kept getting asked in interviews, and I went shopping the other day with my friend in Liverpool. And I just saw it and we burst out laughing and I had to buy it. Yeah, yeah. Talk to us about this play. What's it called? A Murder is Announced. And yes. it's a stage play and it's on tour at the moment. Mm -hmm. That's right. We're doing a big UK tour. We're touring all over the place. Um, we've been to Edinburgh already. Yeah, we're, we're going to go to Belfast. Yeah. Yeah. Everywhere. I mean, it goes all over the place. We're in Brighton this week, which yes. is very nice. So really fun. We're going to the pier tomorrow. Oh, yes. lovely. When's, and, it, um, when's it set? Is it set in the uh, 30s or what? 50s. In the 50s. 1952, on mm. Friday the 13th of April, 1952. And you have to talk and it's like all, that. it's all very, yes, absolutely, yes. And it's very nice because people get to see us doing something which ain't EastEnders. Yeah, you know, absolutely. Which, uh, yeah. which is yeah, great. Yeah, completely. Um, and, uh, in fact, we, um, we're brother and sister in it, mm. aren't we? Oh, and very upper, uh, very upper crust. Yes. Mm -hmm. very upper and who's crust. who's slain? Who's who's who's, who's first? Oh, you see, you can't be in a who done it. No. You can say who's killed, can't you? Can't well, you can say who, who's actually first to hit the boards. Um, can you? No, because it's all right. Don't then, if it's no, 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 I don't want to bully you. It's nearly as big as who shot Phil in Brighton. Well, thank you very much, Layla. Thank you very much, Nina. Looks like you're having fun with life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not very happy.